It's an important phone call and paper in the mail, and you may have ignored it. Paula Tutman explaining right now why the American Community Survey is so important. It's called the American Community Survey, and it is a mammoth 46-page document you may be tempted to ignore if you've already filled out your census quick form, but don't. Equally as important as the regular census, those who get this document have a responsibility that goes beyond just themselves and their household. Every 10 years, it's a big deal. We have to count every person in America. But every year, the Census Bureau conducts a smaller survey called the American Community Survey. That looks to get a sample from every community so they can update our numbers. Those households randomly chosen for the American Community Survey represent thousands. You basically become a representative sample for much of your community and the entire nation. Only invited applicants can complete the American Community Survey. So if you get one of those American Community Survey forms, the longer form, it's extra important if, that you complete it. Because if you don't complete it, Nobody else is completing it in your place. The questionnaire is specific and some might think even invasive. It's really designed by the statisticians at the Census Bureau to help them update a variety of figures. You're asked how many people are in your home, ethnicity, how much money each person makes, whether you're self-employed, who pays for insurance, or even if you have insurance at all. They want to understand if you're paying rent or a mortgage and how much you're paying. Questions that give a sample snapshot of what's going on in your specific community. How much are you paying on mortgage or rent? And how much are your utilities? Help those statisticians to analyze disparities across America. How much is somebody uh, in Mount Clemens paying for utilities as a portion of the rent versus somebody in Grand Rapids? It helps them drill down and analyze those more nuanced community indicators that helps us understand the communities in America. There are three ways to fill out the American Community Survey. You can fill it out on the actual form, online, or when a census worker tracks you down, and they will. They can help you fill it out over the phone. But it is critically important that you not ignore this document and do your civic duty to fill this out along with the regular census form if you haven't already. I'm also being told that this is particularly important to minorities and people who have been underserved, underrepresented, or historically misrepresented, particularly in terms of finances and education. Because if you do get this form, this sets the record straight. Paula Tutman, Local 4.